We already know how this is gonna go. Whoever's ready, I'm out. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, welcome back to another episode of the Zach Rowe Open Challenge. Answering the challenge today, El Jantonio. That is why I, Joe Anthony, am on commentary. Obviously, you're used to hearing El Jantonio, JTW commentator, as well as now JTW tag team champion. One half of the tag team champions with his partner, Malasalto. El Jantonio, Malasalto beat JD Bailey and Bad B last month to win the JTW Tag Team Championships. And now El Jantonio going to answer Zach's open challenge, maybe try and pick up his first singles title in JTW, the Intercontinental Championship. Let's see how this goes down. What's El Jantonio got to say? Me. Me. I beat you in the Tag Team Tournament. Yeah, well, you see, El Jantonio, you may have pinned me in the Tag Team Tournament. But everyone saw it. That was a triple threat match. That was not a one-on-one. -on -one. This is a one-on-one. -on -one. So prove yourself this time. Yes, sir. I'm coming to you in the Continental Championship. These two Wait, shaking sir. hands. This match is going to be official. Zach taking off the championship. Both men going to look to get ready. And here it is, ladies and gents. It is official. El Jantonio versus Zach Rowe in the Intercontinental Championship match. When we're ready, where's the bell? We are going to be underway in three, two, one. Oh, sling blade by Zach straight away to El Jantonio. Zach straight on the offense. Ironically enough, El Jantonio's debut was like two years ago, a few days ago. And that was against Zach Rowe. Uh, three years ago, sorry. Irish whip. Big clothesline. Zach won that match in literal seconds. Uh, El Jantonio has already outlasted himself, which is crazy. But... Already down. Now, no, kicking up to his feet, kicking Zach in the process, bouncing off of the post, and a quick drop kick to the shoulder of Zach Rowe. El Jantonio bouncing back up. Zach goes down. What's El Jantonio thinking here? Scouting him. Big elbow drop by El Jantonio to the Intercontinental Champion, making a quick cover attempt. One, no, kick out at one by Zach. Too early on, El Jantonio. What you like, don't delay. You, you know, when it's Zach, you've got to keep going on the offense, otherwise, he's just going to beat you. Oh, and now El Jantonio with a front face lock, but Zach with repeated punches, countering it. Big shot to the head by the Intercontinental Champion. Beautiful punch. Picking El Jantonio up once again. What's he thinking here? Kick to the gut of El Jantonio, front face hook of his own, DDT planted El Jantonio on his head. No pinfall attempt by the Intercontinental Champion though. Zach Rowe now stomping away on the chest. Now the arm, we see Zach Rowe do this, he targets each of the limbs on your body and stomps on every single bit of them. It's insanely painful. Stomping on the wrist now, El Jantonio moving back up to his feet. Zach Rowe rolling him over. And now just repeated punches over and over again to the head of poor El Jantonio, facing the wrath of Zach here. Zach gets off, giving him a second to recover. El Jantonio is back up to his feet. Looking for a test of strength, maybe show of respect between these two. There is a mutual respect there, as you saw by the handshake at the beginning. But this test of strength, El Jantonio is no match for Zach Rowe. He's trying, but no, Zach planting him down. Oh, what's El Jantonio doing? Zach may be trying to pin him here, but no, El Jantonio pulls himself back up to his feet. What's he thinking here? Massive chop to the chest. Did you hear that? Drop kick by El Jantonio to Zach Rowe. Got him down. What's he thinking here? Tell him to get up. Oh, and a big kick to the face. Let's look at that replay. Jesus Christ. El Jantonio just booted Zach in the face. Beautiful roundhouse kick. Clocking the Intercontinental Champion straight in the mush. One, two, kick out by Zach. If he isn't out cold, he's not going down. Zach Rowe's an incredibly tough competitor. Incredibly tough person to beat. I've only done it a few times in my backyard career. El Jantonio's never done it. He did pin Zach in a triple threat match, but that doesn't really count. Japanese arm drag. Here we go again. Second Japanese arm drag by El Jantonio. And is he going to finish off the comeback? Yes, big drop kick to the face of Zach Rowe. Uh, Zach Rowe got pinned by El Jantonio and JD Bailey in the tag team qualifying triple threat match. Uh, but that is not a one-on-one -on -one pinfall going to El Jantonio. He may not be looking for a pinfall, maybe a submission instead. Boston Crab locked in, but Zach manages to throw him off. 
Both men down, both men quickly trying to recover. This match has gone on only for a few minutes now, but both men are already feeling it. And a big Superman punch, dropping the luchador down. Zack, make the cover you may have retained. But no, instead of making the cover, we're just going to get... Zack oh, talking, what's he saying? Oh. You kicked me right in the face, didn't you? Uh, uh, see? Uh, see? See, see this! No, oh, Zach not going to be taking that. Picking El Gentonio up by his head. El Gentonio's groggy as hell. Irish whip into the post. El Gentonio goes head first. And Zach Rowe with a big rolling DDT connected. Beautiful move. Zach Rowe with that mental DDT combination. We've seen it before. Rolls through, drops to the opponent straight on his head. What's he thinking here? Got El Gentonio by the waist. And a big German suplex just planted El Gentonio. Jesus Christ. That was insane. Zach Rowe may be looking for a second. We've seen him do this with Jack Sykes. Will he hit the trio? El Gentonio saying no, but I don't think he's got much choice in the matter. Second German suplex. El Gentonio just got tossed halfway across the trampoline. And he is down and out. Is Zach going to be going for the triple? Yes, I believe he is. Picking him up from a waist lock position. He's got El Gentonio. No, El Gentonio. Big back elbow reversal. Bouncing off of the post. And a quick hurricane runner by El Gentonio. Didn't get all of it. Cover him. One, two, kick out. Wait, hang on. Hang on. That was that was too close to call, ladies and gentlemen. I believe that may have been a three, but this match is continuing. El Gentonio is disputing it, saying that that was a three count. I'm going to have to watch that back afterwards. That was close. Oh, and Zach with a big chop to the chest of El Gentonio. Not going to let that get him down. Got him. Oh, quick. Rolling row. The rolling row connected, planting him on his face. Zach row one, two. Kick out by El Gentonio at two. Zach row using that rolling row a lot more than uh, a lot more than he has previously recently. He's hit that move on El Gentonio before, actually. But... No, rolling row here did not work. Did not put him away. Zach Rowe getting down onto his uh, down onto his knees and hammering the ground. We may be looking for the spear, uh, and I believe he is. Yes, Uar calling for El Gentonio. Come on, big clothesline attempt by El Gentonio. No spear, cutting him in half. What a spear! One, two, three, and just like that, Zach Rowe has retained the JTW Intercontinental Championship, spearing El Gentonio completely out of his boot. That was beautiful. But ladies and gentlemen, Zach Rowe's Open Challenge successful once again. Zach is still your Intercontinental Champion. Let's see what he has to say. I've been Joe Anthony, and I will see you in the next one. Goodbye. Still, your JTW IC champion. Ah! Ah. Ah.